So please don't, don't knock my stuff over, girl. Good morning, everyone. <laughs> Ooh, who's going to have some coffee with me? Who's going to join me? I see there's 11 people. No, 12. Hit the thumbs up, guys. Good morning. I see there's 11 people. No, 12. I forgot to turn my sound down. Again. <laughs> Nobody's chatting this morning? Or are y'all not awake yet? There we go. Found treasures by Jean. Good morning. Hey, Sally. Hi, Denise. How you doing, Marianne? Hi, Terry. Hi, Shelly. Thanks for joining me for coffee. Hi, Patricia. Good morning. This is not a very large thrift haul, so... <laughs> Hi, Carmen. Good morning. No worries. I won't tell. <laughs> I won't tell. I'm looking over at my oven because I have something in it. And the timer's going to go off. I might as well just get up and shut it off. That's okay, Sally. Whatever you, you know, tea, hot chocolate, whatever. What up, Hazel? <laughs> I got your email. I just I haven't had a chance to answer you back yet, um, Hazel. I forgot to uh, include the that picture in your invoice of the lady playing the piano. Let me shut my oven off, guys. Hold on. Give me one second. I meant to do it before I went live and totally forgot. I hope these are done. They should be after an hour. Okay. I'm, I, I'm trying to do some uh, cooking ahead, you know. <laughs> um. Okay, good. <laughs> Yes, she is, Miss Sally. This morning, I have a very small Salvation Army thrift haul. Good morning, Jan. Good morning, Revive It. And a, a, a small haul from Goodwill. The thrift hauls are getting smaller and smaller, guys. <laughs> you know, what can I say? But... At least I have some stuff for you. Good morning, Carrie. Good morning, Julie. I just got done printing out all my shipping labels for everyone that paid their invoices. So now I just got to stick them on the boxes and I'll schedule my pickup for tomorrow. My mailman is so wonderful. Yeah, I know, Sally. It's just ridiculous. It's absolutely ridiculous. Carrie's got her coffee. Awesome. Awesome. There was something I... Oh, I know. I was going to ask you guys. Is there any interest in um, vintage copper jello molds? Because I have a ton that I'm going to be getting rid of. You're going to make your second breakfast? Because if there's interest, I'll bring them to the sales. If not, I'll just redonate them, I guess. Or maybe put them on Mercari or something. Oh, I forget you work nights. 
um, Marianne. I could never do it. I can't even keep my eyes open past like nine o'clock. <laughs> There's no way I would be able to work um, midnights. No way in hell. No way. All right. I don't see any comments on the jello mold, so there must be no interest. Um, what else was I going to ask y'all? So I didn't make my corned beef and cabbage yesterday because, good morning, Peacock. I was just saying, hey, Wortley, what's up? Good morning, girl. You got your coffee? Um, I didn't make the corned beef yesterday because I was busy packing orders. And I just, I was too busy to bother. So I'm going to do it today. But I don't think I'm going to film it because I'm going to try the um, oven method. And basically, you're just throwing everything in a big pan and putting it in the oven. I have I have an instant pot, but I I always buy two corned beefs because I love it. My daughter loves it. My son loves it. So I always buy two. Why is my printer going off? Well, Binks was in my office and he stood on my laptop and reprinted all my labels and wasted all my damn labels. Yeah, it does shrink a lot. So that's why I always buy, um, I buy two. Oh my God. <laughs> Jason, good morning, my friend. How are ya? <laughs> yeah, hi, Carrie Ann. So now I have all these extra labels that I can just throw out. Six bucks. <laughs> I know, right, Mary Ann? Binks is just, come here, dude. Come here. Come here. Come here, bubbies. <laughs> Come here. Come here. Where are you going? People want to see you. Come here. Come see mommy. He's like, you just yelled at me. I don't know if I want to come near you. Come here. Come here. Come here. Ugh. Say good morning, everyone. Look, his, his scar's healing up. He goes uh, Saturday to get his stitches out. Say hello, everyone. Here I am with my crazy mom. Right, Bubbies? Right? You love your mommy, huh? Yes. <laughs> yes, he does. He's my boy. All right, go on with your bad self. <laughs> He's looking like, uh, can you put me down now, please? I'm not in the mood. He is. He's my baby boy. I just love him to pieces. He really is. He just gets into stuff, you know, like he's a nut, you know, he's just a little nut. What can I say? He will play with anything that he finds on the floor. Hair tie, twist tie, uh, a piece of lint, food. I mean, he's a nut. Really, Lori? <laughs> hey, Christy. Good morning. Well, let me tell you, he does entertain me because he is funny. 
All my cats are funny. Actually, Max this morning was playing with a twist tie in the hallway. Like, I'm like, what is he doing? And I look and he's got a twist tie and he's playing hockey up and down the hallway. I'm like, whatever floats your boat, dude, you know, knock yourself out. They're just too funny. Too funny. But, um, hey guys, don't forget to hit the thumbs up for me. There's 68 here and only 25 thumbs ups. What's up with that? It's free. It's free. <laughs> so, guys, um, I have very small hauls today, so... I'm going to get started because I have a ton of stuff to do today. As usual, it's my day off. Oh, yeah. Bottle caps, uh, 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 caps off of water bottles. You know what I mean? They're just like, they're nuts. Actually, I'm going to grab my... You didn't? Because I realized I I for, I didn't hit send on um, someone's invoice yesterday, so I had to do it today. I'll go back and look, Jan. I'll uh, I'll send it. I'll do it again. Hi, Cindy. Okay, I'll I'll do it. As soon as I'm done here, I'll go in and I'll and I'll send it. Sorry about that. I had a lot of orders, so it was like ah. <laughs> Good morning, Leona. I'm going to grab my cart so that I can put this stuff on it when I'm done. So I can just wheel it in my inventory room. All right. Let's get started. Have a sip of my coffee and we shall begin. Exactly. Don't you wish kids were like that? <laughs> um, yeah, so I was saying I, I, I'm not going to record the corned beef and cabbage a video because I'm just going to throw it all in a giant pan together and throw it in the oven. I've never done it like that before, so I'm going to try it and see how it comes out. We'll see what happens. All right. Salvation Army. Hey, Ariana. How are you, sweetheart? <laughs> Jason. Jason, did you not see my video where I was imitating Pete Puma? You must not have seen it, because I figured you'd be dying. I figured you'd be dying laughing. <laughs> right, Peacock Parlor? Oh, my God. Um, It's the video where I'm holding a blue and white teapot. I do it right in the beginning. I was laughing at my own damn self. <laughs> yeah, I crack my own self up. Oh, that's okay, Lori. <laughs> Good morning, Diane. Um, all right, so <laughs> uh, I spent $49.53 at uh, Salvation Army. So this is what I got. I... <laughs> Yes, that's why I put the link for it in some of the comments. Oh my God, Lori, you're you are hilarious. Um, because some people had no idea who he was, so I had to make sure that I put the link in their in their comments so that they could check it out. I hope they did because I think it's hilarious, but. That's just me. Small things amuse small minds, you know? <laughs> okay. 
Well, let me show you these first. I did pick up this pretty uh, Give Thanks sign. And this was originally $20. But I'm not going to do nothing to it. I love it just the way it is. So I waited for this to go on sale. <laughs> Uh, right, Jason? I know, Lori is crazy. I would love to meet her one of these days and go out and have drinks with her because we would definitely get in trouble. Possibly arrested. <laughs> Give Tom Hanks. <laughs> Lori, are you drinking already, girl? Your vision's crossed. Then I got this. I thought this was really cute for people that love farmhouse. Hey, Geneva. <laughs> That's very true, Lori. How cute is this? I love it. So I got that. I thought it was awesome. Um, hi, Cheryl. <laughs> right? Um, I was watching, of course, you know, the Disney Channel is all that's ever on at my daughter's house. And Goofy is my favorite Disney character. And I had never heard him say this before. Hi, Brenda. The word hilarious, he goes, that is hilarious. I said, hilarious. I was cracking up laughing. And Winnie's looking at me like, what the hell is wrong with my grandmother? I never heard him say that word before. And I was dying. I was dying. He's the best. Goofy is the best. So, anyways, I just had to throw that in there. Hi, Poppy. Bobbies, what are you into now? Oh, he's like a kid. He's like a kid, my cat. But anyways, back to the haul. I got this bag of uh, Spanish moss for my little assemblages and floral arrangements. I'm trying to keep an eye on the kid over here. He's going to break something. I know it. He's got 600 windows in this house to look out of, and he has to try to get in the one that he can't get into. You know? All right. Then I got these, these beautiful, look at the size of these shakers. Oh, my. Silver-plated Hong Kong. I love these. I have a set of these myself, actually. They're on my, my coffee table. You know, she said she would, she would come with Winnie. Because, you know, she doesn't want her on the internet very much. So, but she said she would come sometime when I do a sale. And um, so for everybody, so she could see her. So, all right, then I got this vintage um, jewelry box. Look how cute that is. I don't know if anybody would want it. Hey, hello, LaDonna. How you doing? I know. Right, Lori, do you have a YouTube channel? Because if you do, I did not know you did. So you don't. Oh, okay. Uh, 
avocado leaf tea with you this morning. All right. Sounds good, Poppy. I do have my sage tea, but I'm just I'm just finishing up my coffee. Don't want any tea. I want coffee. <laughs> <laughs> three or four. <laughs> yeah, three or four. Anyway, so there's that. <laughs> um, <laughs> then I got this beautiful basket. I've had a few of these. Hi, Robert123. How are you? <laughs> Jason. Full entertainment, right? <laughs> Hilarious. <laughs> oh my God. You guys, I you guys bring it out in me. I don't know what it is. I can't help it. Second like cup of coffee and I just lost all desire to drink it. What's up with that, LaDonna? <laughs> I got this beautiful basket. Excellent condition, no damage on it. <laughs> Y'all, I got so it is therapy because you know what you know what it is I don't go anywhere really so I'm not around adults very often <laughs> yeah I don't have any Baileys I told you Lori um hi Jennifer so when I get around y'all I just like kick it <laughs> let it loose Unwind. Right, Julie? The only time I see adults is if I go to, like, thrifting. <laughs> I even order my damn groceries because I'm too lazy to go to the store <laughs> and do it myself. Ever since COVID with, the, with the, the grocery delivery, I have taken full advantage of it. I know, Denise, oh my God. I did go to New York City once and the whole trip was a blur because we were drunk every single night. <laughs> we met these guys from Ireland. Oh my God. They were crazier than crazy. We had a blast. <laughs> Are we, Julie? <laughs> Okay, I got some awesome vintage purses. Look at these purses. <laughs> it's so much easier though, right, Donna? It's like, I know. All right, I got this awesome, look at this vintage purse, guys. I know I have a problem with vintage purses. I just do. Look at this purse. I mean, it's in excellent condition. I can't help myself. Oh, I love them. And I got this one, Silver Lame. It does have a little, like a scratch in the fabric here. See that? Gigi the Crochet Queen. Well, good morning. Thank you. I love vintage purses. I mean... How awesome is that? Look at the handle. Do you, Carmen? I do too. Then I got this one. Look at this one. 
This one, this is just uh, from sitting on top of a the uh, handle. Um, hey, how you doing, Kim? Hi, Gloria. This is just gorgeous. Look at the clasp. I mean, these purses are in amazing condition. Oh, my goodness. And the last one, where do you see this one? Kim, you came in at the perfect time. <laughs> Look at this purse. OMG. Look at that clasp. Oh my goodness. I mean, it doesn't get any better than that. Oh my gosh, she's here for the <laughs> for the comic relief. Oh my god, Carmen. I saw these and I was like, I I I don't need them. But I know you do, Kim. <laughs> I have to get them. And hopefully they sell because they're amazing. They are amazing. How many hankies I could fit in that bag? Probably a ton. I also got this, this little um, trinket box. All the flowers and the leaves are intact, if you can believe it. This is Sierra Madre, California. Oh my God, that's where my aunt and uncle live. Sierra Madre, California. Oh my God, I got to show this to my aunt. Oh my gosh, isn't it pretty? So I got that. I found a beautiful, back in the day they loved hankies. Snot rags to us, yes. I used to I used to tell my dad, I'm like, dude, how can you blow your snots all in that hanky and then stuff it in your pocket? I said, that is so gross. Ew. I got this beautiful pink depression nappy dish. Yep, my dad too. I just think it's gross. I I know. I'm like, he said, oh, you're crazy. <laughs> no, I don't think so. <laughs> Chanel number five. So I got that. I know, I know it's the generation, but you need to kind of like move into the century and get rid of the hanky and use Kleenex. It's much more sanitary. Up the sleeve, yes, yes. I can't tell you how many, how many, um, when I worked at the nursing home, I can't tell you how many times we found Kleenexes up in their clothes and stuff. Absolutely. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, I have this gorgeous, this is Wedgwood. This beautiful blue and white plate. Werther's original, yep. <laughs> yeah, isn't that gorgeous? And I like like I said, it's Wedgwood. It's beautiful. 
I fell in love with that. And then the last thing I got at Salvation Army. So I had found a shut the box game, but it was not in good shape. So I ripped it apart and I'm going to do a thrift flip on it. But I did keep the wood dice and it's perfect because I found a new shut the box game that didn't have dice. So now... I got the dice. Um, for those of you that have never played Shut the Box, it's a great game. You need to try it. It's, it's a lot of fun. And so I got that Shut the Box game. So that was everything from Salvation Army, guys, for $49.53. It is a fun game, ain't it, Lori? I love it. We used to play it with the residents at the nursing home. Okay, now. Now on to Goodwill. Should be called Expensive Will. Okay. Okay. Thank you, Cindy. Yeah, I, I always do pretty well at uh, Salvation Army. It's goodwill where it kills me. Oh, do you really, um, Joanne? That's awesome. How are you? All right. Moving on to goodwill. I have a hair or something stuck in my, um, my chapstick. Okay, I got this. Um, where is my receipt from Goodwill? I know it's here somewhere. When I find it, I'll tell you what I spent. No way, LaDonna. No way. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Really? That is awesome. We do you guys see what Vinny found? at uh, Goodwill. I, I was like, no, you didn't. I got this uh, beautiful uh, hand-blown uh, Christmas ornament that's made in Poland. Oh, you saw it? I was like, dang, how come I don't find shit like that? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> But anyway, I got that little guy, and he is stinking adorable. I love it. Oh, good. Very good. Uh, I got myself a bag of cotton balls. I know that's exciting. Woohoo! Cotton balls! <laughs> um... I got this bag of vintage Christmas sun catchers. These are so awesome. Check these out, guys. Well, there was this little guy in there. He's old. He's probably from the 70s, but he's cool. Then we got the candles. Yeah. Yeah. Candles, the stocking. I love sun catchers. An ornament with the candle inside. We got Santa and the candy canes. Good morning, Lorna. <clears throat> I know, aren't they awesome? I always hang them in my windows at Christmas. I have a bunch of them. Yeah. <laughs> hey, here we go. Good morning. 
Well, you know, I was going to record record this, and I'm like, ah, the hell with it. Let me just go live and have coffee with everyone. So here I am. So I got those, which I love. Love, love, love those. Right, Joanne? I know. They really are. They're not flimsy. You know what I mean? Then I got this uh, for Valentine's Day. Ray Dunn XOXO. So we got that. So let me put that down there. Then I got this rolling pin. And I was like, this is so cool. If you're making a pie in the winter for like um, a holiday or a birthday or anything, right? That's in the winter time. Look how cool this rolling pin is. You can roll out your top crust and it'll come out with snowflakes all over it. I'm like, this rolling pin is so cool. I love it. Love, love, love it. Had to get it. I had to get it. You know how I am with the rolling pins, guys. Mm -hmm. Yeah. One of my subscriber friends calls it a, hus a husband something beater. A husband beater. <laughs> yes, it is great. Isn't it cool? I love it. Um, people also could use it that who make cakes um, on fondant and stuff like that. <laughs> I know I keep forgetting. I keep forgetting to put the rolling pin. Um, Ex-husband beater now. I know, right, Lori? I have three exes. <laughs> so I need lots of rolling pins. <laughs> No, I don't see two of them at all anymore, so that's good. <laughs> um, then I got this. My email address? I sure can. I could put it right in here. There you go. Uh -huh. Yes, Lori. I didn't learn from the first one. I had to do it two more times. Dur -dur -dur. Anyways, I bought this because I was going to do a thrift flip on it. But if somebody likes it um, the way it is, because it is very pretty. That is perfectly fine. I'll hold on to it for a little bit if somebody likes it and wants to buy it as is. If not, it's getting flipped. <laughs> uh, I bought these recipe boxes. These are being flipped. Yeah, well, you know... <clears throat> it happens. Um, I don't know. Doesn't bother me. Doesn't bother me anymore. Um, but anyways, I got these to uh, flip. You're very welcome, Karen. So I got those. Then I found another plastic bag holder. I haven't found one of these in a while. And I picked it up to, to do a thrift flip. Um, but if somebody, if somebody likes it as is, uh, just let me know. And I'll leave it as is and they can purchase it like this. If not, it's going to get a flip. It's going to get a thrift flip.
Yeah, I don't know what I'm going to do on them yet, Joanne. I have no idea. We'll see. I did get this gorgeous, this gorgeous frame. Look at this frame. Isn't that beautiful? Oh, my goodness. It needs... <laughs> That's it, Sally. I will take that as they just can't handle me. That's, yeah. Um, this needs a beautiful Victorian picture in it. So we'll see. We shall see. Then, you guys, I got these two. I got two of these frames. Isn't it gorgeous, Kim? I was like, oh my gosh. Stunning frame. Stunning frame. Then I found two of these. Now, they don't have any glass in them. Um, hey, does anybody know, does Hobby Lobby cut glass for picture frames? Does anybody know if they do that? Because I know they have a framing department. But I didn't know if they actually, they do. Because I have some beautiful um, antique frames that have no glass. So I was thinking I need to take them and have glass cut for them. Do they really? Well, that's awesome. We don't have an Ace Hardware here where I live. We have... Um, we have uh, True Value, and we have uh, Home Depot. Huh. <laughs> but anyway, I got two of these frames. Um, I was going to do something with them uh, without the glass. So we'll see. They were made in Mexico. That's what it says on the bottom. Mexico. Hey, Brigia. Oh, thank you. Yeah, she was really good. She was really good too. Really, Cheryl. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna have to take them over to um, Hobby Lobby then. Excellent. I wasn't sure. I was. I've been meaning to call them to find out. Um, excellent. Thank you, Cheryl. Fabulous. How you doing? All right. I got this bag of eggs. Look how pretty the sugared eggs. Yeah, I love Hobby Lobby. There's that one. There's this one. Aren't these pretty? I love these. I wish I knew how they made them. Hello. Nini, this one's pretty. Look at this one. So, so pretty. American Glass and Mirror on Military Road. Oh. Huh. Hey, Fly Girl. What's up? Yeah, I don't know about all this... Uh, Yeah, and then also in the bag, which makes no sense to me, uh, is a bag of balloons. <laughs> it's 
and a fridge magnet. Decoupage an egg, then use whatever to sugar it. Oh, yeah, a mirror. I could put have a mirror put in it. Oh, well, thank you there, Marianne. Oh, I got those. Yeah, I know, right, Lisa? <laughs> oh, definitely from the 70s. Absolutely. I was going to say, I was going to say 70s. You read my mind. Now I have balloons. Um, I also got these patriotic bells, which I will unattach from this. I don't, I don't really like that. She's good. She's very good. Um, I would, I would pair these with another patriotic item, you know, as a little lot. But I just loved them. I thought they were so cute, the bells. So I got those. Then I got three more of these mini. Hey, my jewelry addiction. I forget your first name. I am so sorry. Oh, I got three of these mini loaf pans to do some um, assemblages in. So I got, I grabbed three of those. They're made by Echo. So I got those for crafting. Tanya, okay. Oh yes, I've seen that done. I've seen that done. Um, if you want the balloons, Brie, I'll send them to you. Because <laughs> I have no use for them. Then I got. Oh, he's doing wonderful. I had him on at the beginning of the video. Now he's sleeping in his bed over there. Then I got this set of three Temptations mini loaf pans Christmas with lids. We got snowflakes, reindeer, another reindeer with the red background and the white reindeer. Aren't those nice? Really nice. Temptations. Temptations. So I got those. I just got, oh, there's my receipt. Two things left. Aren't they? I found this cigar box with the latch and I am going to do a thrift flip on this. It is pretty though. Look at that label. Isn't that a pretty label for cigars? Look at. That's really pretty, you know? It's so cool. I know, Cindy. That's why I grabbed them. I wonder if I could actually get this off without ripping it. I would have to heat it up. I know, right? I would have to heat it up with my heat gun. I might, I'm going to try to get it off without, um, without ripping it. But, yeah, so I got that box. And the last item I got, I believe um, this is Fostoria. Um, I have to wash it. It's gorgeous. I think it's Rose Point. Maybe it's New Martinsville. I don't know. I can't remember. Um, this beautiful relish dish, divided relish. And it is in perfect condition. There's no chips, cracks, or flea bites on it. And it is just a beautiful piece of elegant depression glass. I love it. Oh, I know people collect cigar boxes for sure. Uh, sorry, Hazel. <laughs> You're going to.
gonna need a U-Haul pretty soon. <laughs> so yeah. So that's everything that I got from Goodwill. And I spent 70 bucks. 70 bucks. So not bad. And you know, I know it's beautiful. I think it's I think it's Rose Point, the pattern, but I'm not positive. I'd have to look in my book. Um so, yeah, that's what I got for you guys uh, today. And then tomorrow, I'll be going thrifting again. So, thank you so much. Uh, thanks for joining me today, guys. Um, yeah, so I'm going to get going. I have to uh, label all my boxes. Um... I just got a ton of stuff to do, and there's just not enough hours in the day. Yes, Senior Tuesday. Oh, you're welcome. I enjoy I enjoy uh, having coffee in a thrift hall with you guys and chatting. So I hope you guys have a wonderful day. No, tomorrow. Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday is when I babysit. So Monday and Wednesdays are my days off so to speak, my day's off from babysitting, but I don't really have a day off, per se. <laughs> oh, my goodness. All right, you guys, have a great day, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys. <laughs>